Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, to the world of Wayne, and uh, you can see I've got a big smile on my face because once again Mike Lane's come through and he's made some more mods for the build the DeLorean model from Eagle Moss, and I'm sure you're going to be really impressed with these. We've got three to show you on this occasion, so without further ado, let's show you what we've got. Okay, I'm going to use a lot of close-ups that I got from Mike Lane's website himself. And if you want to go over to his website and see these for yourself, I'm going to put it down in here and it's going to be there for the whole video. So feel free to go over there, turn me off and go over to his site and just see exactly what I'm talking about. The first one we've got is the 18 keys and tag set. And when you get this, it comes to you like this. And in this pack, as you can see, we've got the uh, key tag here. And then we've got all the keys which are brass etched on uh, a metal piece here to cut off to make yourself. Now you make the keys, uh, they do make a, uh, a a bundle of keys in the end one of the keys is going to be half the uh, length as you can see in this picture here which enables you to attach it to the barrel you could also if you wanted to attach it to the doors but when you've have actually finished them this is what it looks like now they are really tiny so I'm showing you like these but again I'm going to put a picture up on the screen just to show you how detailed these are and obviously you know that these keys are metal uh, but this is absolutely brilliant. It's another bit of detail, which I wouldn't have thought of before, but now you see it, you're like, wait, hang on, why have you not installed this before anyway? Um, so that's the uh, the keys, the 18 key tags. Uh, you do get them unmade, you have to make them yourself, but I think that's more of the challenge for you uh, to do that, because that's how they come, and it's full instructions how to do that. Uh, the second thing we've got is the plutonium case and clock face. Now look at these pictures here again. Now I've already done this to mine. So if I lift mine up there, you can see it stops all the rods jangling around like before. We've now got foam at the back here, foam inside here to stop them all moving around. And they're really easy to fit, including a bit of plastic in here, which stops the rod shaking up and down as well. Uh, we've also got the decal, the radiation decal on there. And again, if you look at some of these close-up pictures, uh, direct from Mike Lane's site, I'm sure you'll agree, this makes absolute sense that uh, we should install this. Now, when Mike does give them you, as you can see, you've got a full page of instructions, so it's really easy to fit these. You're not gonna have a problem fitting them, but if you haven't got to this stage at the moment, believe me, you're gonna be fingers and thumbs as they just keep falling all over the place and the tops keep coming off and they're just, whoa, it's just a nightmare. And uh, this is a problem solver that I'm sure once you've actually done that issue, I think that was issue 100, wasn't it? Uh, you'll realize you're gonna need that. And to that end, you do get another thing as well, which was quite disappointing in the Eagle must delete uh, release which is the alarm clock now the alarm clock face was pretty terrible uh, but he's got a decal in there to make that a lot of better for you and i'll show you a close-up picture but there's my one because i've already put it on and that's the alarm clock we can hell of a lot better than it did but that all comes in that pack and uh, I've left the uh, my favourite thing till last because as soon as I got this, it was the first thing I installed on the car. And yes, believe it or not, it's already installed on the car now. And that is magnetic wheel caps. And it, you, we, we needed this from like issue four. Um, basically, I had two wheel caps which were damaged anyway. I had one which was like got a hollow hole in it and one where the DMC had logged out. Uh, and I couldn't get some of them out either. But in this magazine, in this like instruction, sorry, tells you exactly how to do that. Um, um, but they're magnetic, so check this video out. Look how easy it is. Just they pop in, and then you use this little tool here, which I've got one myself here, a little magnet, and that'll enable them to come out as easy as well. And when you look at the close-up of them, you can see the detail is amazing. Now, the uh, you get five of these. You get four for the tyres and one for the spare. And uh, they're invaluable if you're going to be doing the extended editions because uh, you're going to need to take these out to take the wheels off. And before to do that, it meant damaging those wheel hubs. Well, not anymore with these magnetic wheel hubs. Uh, this in itself is going to save you a big load of pain and a big load of damage. But look at my smile. <laughs> those wheel caps are amazing, Mike. So listen, thank you for sending me those. If you want to check these out for yourself, just go down to Mike's link down there and uh, you'll be able to see all of his mods, not just the ones you've seen here. And that includes all the decal packs, the carpet. I mean, the speedometer. Mike, Mike's done absolutely loads for the DeLorean. So if you are building the DeLorean, uh, he's the must-go-to guy uh, to get all your mods that you need for this. So, uh, But listen, I really do hope you like that video. I really do hope you'll check out his website uh take care thanks for watching if you like this video please remember to give it a like and if you haven't done so already please remember to subscribe take care